In this video, we're gonna be talking about some accessories for the Black Magic Pocket Cinema Camera 4K. I know, I have a feeling that this camera is gonna be shipping real soon. I know a lot of people in Asia already have their hands on it. So what we're gonna do today is just talk about some of the accessories you can get with this camera before actually getting it so that when you do have it and get it in the mail, you're ready to go. Now, I'm not gonna go crazy. This is very minimal. If you've seen my videos before, I go for the minimal setup. I'm just gonna do what I would get, right? So the first one, we're gonna have, I have some notes here so I don't forget. Now, the first one we're gonna talk about is SSD drives. CFast 2.0 cards are still kind of expensive right now, but the Blackmagic Pocket Cinema Camera 4K also records via USB-C onto SSD hard drives, which right now, a Samsung one, a T5 SSD right now on Amazon is going for 200 some dollars for one terabyte. That's a freaking steal. So if you don't wanna spend a lot of money on CFast 2.0 cards or just memory cards, period, mind you, you have to find a way to somehow mount this SSD card on your rig. But that's where the second accessory comes in, which is the 8 sin half cage for the BMP CC 4K. As far as I know, they are gonna be coming out with a attachment to this half cage that will attach your T5 SSD hard drive or any SSD hard drives onto the half cage so it's not just kind of like Velcroed or taped around your camera. So take a look at this 8 sin half cage. The next thing we're gonna talk about is Metabone's Speed Booster. As you all know, this camera is a micro four thirds lens camera. So if you have Canon lenses, Nikon lenses, and all those kind of lenses, and you want to adapt it to the Blackmagic Pocket Cinema Camera 4K, you're gonna need some type of speed booster. Now, I've been using Metabone speed boosters since they pretty much came out with the original BMCC, BMPCC. Right now, as far as I know, my Metabone speed booster that I'm using my GH5S will work with the Blackmagic Pocket Cinema Camera 4K. Just stay tuned whenever I get the camera, I will verify that. I know some users are having good luck using it, but not all speed boosters are the same. So just stay tuned for that one, but speed booster is definitely a must for the Blackmagic Pocket Cinema Camera 4K to reduce the crop factor of the camera. Another accessory that you might wanna look at is the DTAP to Limo power adapter that Blackmagic Design is actually selling. So that means that you can use a V-mount or something like this to power your camera, which is much better than the Canon LPE6s. So if you, want to, if you have a long shoot or something like that, go ahead and grab a V-mount and this adapter that Blackmagic Design sells so you can shoot for longer times. Okay, so that's all I have for you guys right now. Like I said, it's very minimal. I didn't add my gimbal in there because to be honest, I don't know if it's gonna work with my setup because I have a pretty heavy setup. Now, when I do get it, just stay tuned, go ahead and subscribe. I'm gonna see if my setup will work with Design Crane 2 and Blackmagic Pocket Cinema Camera 4K. If you have any questions, let me know and I'll see you guys later.